Hi everyone, I hope you are all doing well and enjoying your life. Um, I'm welcoming you in my video where I'm going to show my experience uh, regarding uh, replacement of uh, RAMs in my Dell laptop over here. That's my laptop. It's Core i7. Uh, the model number is uh, Inspire On 15 and uh, further details are 5559. It's i7. Quite old one, uh, not the latest one, but anyway, that's the reason why I need to upgrade uh, my RAMs. So it was containing 2 into 4 GB RAMs. Obviously, because of the passage of time, uh, the, the, the performance is not as expected. I just brought these two RAMs from Amazon. It's 8 GB each, made in Korea, SK Hynix. And the reason why I went for H SK Hynix was um, that perhaps this my laptop already is including the similar RAMs. So in order to avoid any potential issues for the compatibility, I opted for 2 into 8 GB RAMs. Um, Alright, so just a brief. Again, uh, that's my Core i7. 15 triple five nine in spiral the maximum capacity of this laptop was to hold only uh, 2 into 8 GB so that's where I'm at the moment so basically I'm doubling my RAMs from existing 8 GB to uh, globally 16 GB RAM uh, so stay with me I'm I'll just quickly uh, wrap up the next few moments of this video uh, obviously we need a little uh, square type of screw and um, I'm gonna open this laptop so basically we have two main parts from the bottom uh, the RAM of uh, Dell laptop sits over here in this part so in, in reality we're gonna open this one this one screw and the second screw let me not waste the time or quickly unscrew them and I'm gonna show you how it looks like from inside so coming back to the rear side of the laptop that's we can see here the hard drive and yeah perhaps yeah this one let me take the angle so that's an existing SK Hynix but made in China 4GB RAM and they are two one is installed like this and second one is uh, installed in this direction how we're gonna open them uh, it's a tricky one but let me try to so this one we're gonna push these two knobs and it, it is gonna open it automatically I'm sure you are able to see so that's how I removed the first 4 GB RAM so again so there are tiny clips on both sides we just need to push them outwards and then automatically the RAM will come out uh, hopefully this should work here also I'm just pushing this one here that one on the other side and here you can see the RAM already moving out Good. I'm gonna open the second one, not the new one. It's 8 GB. All right. I just unboxed the two new RAMs. Okay. Uh, just uh, plug them here. That's the new one, SK Hynix 8 GB RAM, Korea. Uh, I just push them here a little bit, and now I just need to force them with the clicks on. You are make sure that this is already installed. And just to make, make sure, uh, because of the cut in this uh, slot, uh, you are able to figure out that how you're gonna install it. Obviously, if you put it in, in uh, another direction, it will not fit inside. So, uh, for this second RAM, RAM you need to uh, put it upside down. Again, after putting in, uh, just pushing it inside, yes, I'm gonna push it with the finger. And with the click of, uh, I would say, like kick sound, you are able to 
see that those are properly configured and that's it I'm gonna put this uh, cover back Be careful when it just need to push them from all sides like uh, I would say like a good perfect example of Nokia um, uh, back cover I'm just gonna screw them again and that's that's how that's fast and quickly it is to upgrade your Dell laptop with I mean from uh, 8 GB to 16 GB RAM I hope you like this video stay tuned to my channel and uh, I'll see you in the next video take care bye bye